what perplexity is doing is saying, um, maybe, maybe it's not just about knowledge and answers. Um, uh, maybe it's also about being able to help people take actions uh, through the browser. And I think that's what's really exciting here. Um, you know, in, in, a, in, a, in the perplexity comment browser today, you know, what they're underlying it is um, LLMs, right? You can choose any LLM. You can choose Anthropic Cloud. You can choose uh, OpenAI's models, uh, various open source models like Llama. Uh, you can even use uh, their own uh, fine-tuned uh, perplexity sonar model, right? Um, but the most important thing about the browser is that it's giving you memory and a, a user interface uh, that is quite different. And this is really important. It almost begs to begs the question, is the browser the right is browser the right name for this product? You know, well, the browser used to be about, you know, websites and websites were relatively static and they weren't dynamic apps when the browser the word browser was coined. And now today, you know, the the web is not only a bunch of websites, but it's also most of the applications that you use, right? And so really it's 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 not just browsing apps. You're, it's allowing you to use access and and use these apps. And so, you know, you use them for um, you know, there's SaaS apps that you use for work that are very uh, complex. Um, there's also sort you know fun consumer websites and apps. And so, you know, the the agentic actions that Comet has introduced are really interesting. They have the context of where you're, where you're, what app or what website you're on. And it has the context of what's uh, available on that page. Um, and it also has the memory, uh, the accumulating memory of what you, uh, what your preferences are um, over time. And then the third one is the user interface. So some people might say, hey, I can have um, my search um, open here. I can have a website open here and I can have um, uh, perplexity or chat GPT or Claude open here and I can just move things around information. It, it isn't that good enough? But um, actually it's not good enough because it's not as fluid and as integrated as possible. And so the actions are also made available because you can actually use the browser um, and, and uh, the Comet browser today is uh, able to uh, organize your data. It's able to change your spreadsheets, answer emails at scale. 